No team's ever done it. Wichita State won the tournament in St. Louis. We've been close since 2010 and 2013. We've been in the championship game twice. Nobody's done it. I love the fact that you guys embrace that. Okay? I love the fact that you embrace wanting to be special, wanting to be the one. There's over 4,000 people that made this trip anticipating that. We can't win Sunday if we don't get this one done. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It didn't take a lot of convincing for Wichita State to let me come behind the scenes. I think they're a team that, despite being undefeated, has kind of an interesting national perception of them. Someone inside the program told me we're almost like a ragtag group of guys. Starting from the head coach, Greg Marshall isn't from a famous coaching tree. He came from College of Charleston. Ron Baker was a small-town Kansas kid. Fred Van Vliet is from Rockford, barely, you know, recruited by mostly mid-majors. And so they put together this ragtag team that is, to me, one of the best two or three teams in the whole country. We need to play to our strengths, okay? What, what do you do well? Do that. And then minimize the things that you don't do so well. Hide them. Make them transparent. Play to your strengths. What's surprising to me when you see Wichita State practice, and Greg Marshall's son, Kellen, kind of said this to me later, is that it doesn't seem like an undefeated team. They nitpick at everything, especially defensively, just little breakdowns. They address them, and it's almost like seeing a team that maybe has lost 10 or 15 times, you would think, in how dissatisfied they are with their own performances, even though every clip they're watching is a game they won, and often won handily. We need the same effort today, same effort today. He missed a lot of shots. That game's a little bit, okay? We missed a ton of free throws, all right? But we did it the same thing yesterday. Can't do that again, all right? Let's execute, let's be ready to go. I think they almost are miffed by the fact that, hey, we went to the Final Four a year ago, and we were leading Louisville late into the game. Why would you doubt this team that almost beat the national champion last year and is undefeated this time? I think they're surprised that they're discredited. Respect your opponent, come out with unbelievable energy, we'll be fine. Let's go. Let's go. And you can tell that they're having a lot of fun together. They have a kind of a tradition after games where they sing a victory song. It really feels like a cohesive team, and that's an important thing when you're going through the NCAA tournament to not have a team that's maybe built around one guy, but it's really greater than the sum of its parts. Hey there, SI fans. I hope you enjoyed this clip from our daily live show, SI Now. You can find a link to the complete episode, it's just 30 minutes long, in the description box below. And while you're there, make sure to subscribe to Sports Illustrated's YouTube channel. May not be the swimsuit channel, but just as exciting. Remember, you can watch SI Now Monday through Friday live at 1 p.m. Eastern Time, only on SI.com. There may be a swimsuit model there. We'll see you.